let's continue Animal Crossing New Horizons. If you're watching this later on YouTube, thanks for clicking. Hope you've been enjoying so far. It is the day of the moving out. And as such, now I can look for a new villager. I might get lucky and get one through a campsite. We'll see. All right. I've had a pretty good streak of luck when it comes to finding villages. This is the actual time. R right. I can't actually... Fishing tournament. Okay. They'll have to remember that. But I guess... I can't really focus on money today, so let's just... Not even the hot item thing. The clothing store closes in 15 minutes, so I should have a look at that. I don't think I've heard this one before. This sounds very Peruvian. relatives that are Peruvian. But also you come across some um, pan flute music. Yep, they have officially moved out. All right. So, other than fossils, uh, I'm not going to make money. I'll probably be just Nook Miles. Hey, I'm kind of sewn into my machine right now. Sorry, I can't chat, but thanks for stopping by. Because she's almost there. Conductor. Football. Uh, hippie. I mean, I guess if I'm gonna go look for a villager and explore. to go out into the world. <laughs> Alright, first things first. Oh, Flick is here today. Hi, do you live here? I'm Flick. Kind of a bug buff. An insect and city enthusiast, an anthropod artiste. I love all bugs and their appendages. I've been traveling across all the islands looking for my soul bug, the perfect inspiration for my art. I must capture every wiggling leg, each joint of the antenna. We're so lucky to live in their world. So if you find a bug, loose out to me, pay extra. And that's any bug with devotion. A uh, devotion with conditions isn't devotion at all. And if you're um, interested in my art, let me know. Commissions are open. 
Okay. Alright, so they'll be around for a while. If I can find... Two spiders. I can get a spider model. That's what I'm going to try and aim for. Every last bit of mile I can get. The new inclines should be ready. Yeah. I think this is new. Maybe. Oh, never mind. Okay, but I can sell it. Probably not a fossil. That's somewhere more accessible. Oh no, it is a fossil. Okay. Alright, one more. No spring bamboo. It might be gone now. really much point in me gathering the fruit because I can't sell it anyway. No. <sighs> Wrong thing. There we go. I mean, I guess if I want to make money, flex a good way to do it. Hmm. 
right, say. Oh. Off chance there's a spider. Okay. Tail, Brachio skull. Brachiosaurus, whose name means arm lizard, uh, what? Was one of the largest herbivorous dinosaurs. Due to its long front legs and elongated neck, it seems to have specialized in eating plants up high. Alas, in order to support its large size, it likely needed to eat more or less every waking hour. What a ferocious forager it must have been indeed. And that is what I have to say about that. Okay. Oh, it's complete. Alright, that's another one done. Not a dinosaur despite what some people may tell you, this reptile, not dinosaur, is most famous for its large, sail-like organ on its back. Said organ was likely useful in regulating its non-dinosaur body temperature. Reptiles are known to be cold-blooded, but there is some debate as to where the dinosaurs were too. Okay. I'm sure that was a, uh, a milestone one. Okay, it was both. I got the knock files. the best way to make money today, but I'm not interested in that. Okay. Like 
I'm gonna take it one ticket at a time, as annoying as that might be. <laughs> I'm gonna be a little more picky this time. I just gotta drop off some stuff first. So, I mean, it's good that she's on the island, because now... I forgot to put that down. Um... Because every island I go to, there should be a wasp nest, so... That'll sell well. Is that done, or is the... No, that's done. Okay. I mean, I wanted two decorative ones to put in front of the museum. So we'll see what the other one ends up being. It's not like I can sell the others off now, anyway. See how many tickets I spend. Who is it? It is a bear. <laughs> it's a bear with a love heart. Who are you? I'm not taking this bear, but like, it's just adding to the whole thing where I keep getting told, oh, you only get the cute ones. You get the ones that are like in high demand. It's a, it's a bear with a fucking love heart on it. This is token teddy bear. Two, two, two. Okay. Twinkles. I mean, yeah, I'm sure this is someone's favorite, but this is the first one I've come across, and I'm I'm not going with it. I'm going to be super picky. Oh, 
how many more of these do I have to do? Okay, that's not too bad. Not that I can sell it today. I'm not, no. No. Thing is, when it's eventually, it's not gonna wear that sweater, so half of the impact of the character is gonna be lost. I may as well get the fruit and just store it. I was walking around yesterday picking up DIY stuff and I came up with a great recipe. It's real easy. My head was stuck in my shirt and I still did the DIY. Share the recipe with folks. Poppy, aka DIY man. Poppy sounds more fun than Tutu. I don't know. I just don't like the name. <laughs> it has an innocent meaning, but it also has a non-innocent meaning. Hey, Colin, how's it going? Alright, I mean, it's just the first ticket. I know someone's gonna be unhappy though, I didn't take two two, but that's okay. The appeal here is the if, yes, it's a teddy bear with a love heart, but the love heart is clothing. So it won't always be visible, but you know, it continues the trend of me only running into villages that everyone wants. That's <laughs> Literal fucking teddy bear, jeez. Can't get more teddy bear if I, if I tried. Okay. <laughs> it's Monday, kids are home. Oh. <laughs> I, yeah, long day, Monday. It's one of my longer days of the week. <laughs> So I'm just kicking back with this and going on an, an animal hunt, seeing what I can get as a villager to replace the gorilla who's moved out. Well, 
when's my next day off? Four weeks? Or five weeks? It's like the first week of November. I got lucky. I got lucky and just... On the day that I was preparing and got a bunch of bait, they just decided to want to move out, so... They're gone now. So, I mean, every time I visit one of these islands, it's a minimum of 3,600 bells. I got cherry blossoms. Yes, it is spring here. music. I feel like I've gone to the, uh, a market somewhere and there's just one of these bands selling their CDs. The house looks nice, really? <laughs> it's put, I put stuff down because I ran out of room. Though this carpet thing is something I usually do. Like, okay, yeah, put, put, put this here, put this here, put carpet down, okay. I just placed whatever I could. Alright, so that's one villager. Let's see what villager number two is gonna be. I'm kind of worried, like, just that I'm only gonna run into villagers people want. have a pretty good track record so far. Like, I'd say maybe two or three villages were not great. Every other one has just been like, what the hell? Okay. One ticker at a time, because you never know. This is probably all I'm going to do in Animal Crossing today, since the store is closed. Okay. Alright, let's see villager number two. Oh, another bottle. Oh, okay. Well, it's another cute one, but I had this villager on, on my previous island. This, I had this penguin on uh, my first file from 2020, so that's that's a no. Yes, it is cute. But I've had this villager before. Alright, so teddy bear and penguin. Okay. This 
sweater is fire. I forgot what the sweater is. It's just a frog or something, isn't it? Yeah. Classic canister. I'm guessing that's one of those storage canisters. I should probably catch this because Flick's on the island. Not sure if it's worth much, but... While I'm here, I should catch bugs, since I can sell them right away. Ugh. Oh, this, I this island's infested with these things. What the hell? Ah. Oh. Well... It's okay, I can make a replacement pretty easily. I don't want to take too long on each island, that's why I haven't been digging up the rocks, but I guess in this case I have to. I have enough points saved up to visit 25 islands, something like that. It's just a candle. Aroma pot. That's what it's called? Yeah, what is going on with this island? I'm gonna see how much these are worth. If it's... Hang on, what are they called? Pond skaters? No, giant water bug. Okay, hold on. Giant water bug. New horizons. I wanna see how much they're worth. Flick buys them for 3,000 bells. Each time I catch one of these, it's 3,000 bells. So... <laughs> that's, uh, that's good. I mean, if it's nothing but these, shit. Alright, don't move. Ah, there's someone on the island. That's Wade. Oh, you're visiting here too? I'm Wade. You're Will from Shambolonia. Neat. I didn't expect to make a friend here. This island is so cool. So it goes. Yeah, I mean... Again, cute. But already had on another island. Do I know how to get the bar in the museum? The bar? The coffee shop? I've gotten it before, I just don't remember the exact circumstances. I'm 
that what it is? Yeah, it's a coffee shop. Dude, pause your coffee. He asks you if you want pigeon milk, which I absolutely hated the first time I heard that term. Doesn't sound like a very appetizing thing. I get it's probably the brand of the milk, but still. You thought it was a bar. <laughs> yeah, you know, just this... Very wholesome game. They're gonna serve hard liquor at a museum. So then when parents visit with their kids, they can just get absolutely fucking blitzed. I mean, museum-themed cocktails could work. I guess this, this counts as a special island, because I'm only seeing these bugs here. And every time I get one, it's 3,000 bells, so... I think this, like, one of those sells for a stack of fruit, so... It's definitely worth the effort. Yeah, what the hell? Look at this. This is no joke. Like, one, two, four, six, eight. <laughs> Already gotten 24,000 in bells just from these bugs. That's annoying. This is the first time I'm seeing a special island like this. Spiders would have been nicer, but this is this is not bad as well. Here I thought I wasn't going to make money today because the store was closed. Um, these are not worth... Like I may as well... Even this is just... That's fine. I'll make room for another bug. Um, and, of course, for good measure, I'll wear this so that gives me another slot. Okay. Poor Wade on this this island just full of bugs. It's pretty much like a cockroach island. going. Oh, crap, there's one here already. It's alright, leave that one for a minute. There's another one here. This is pretty lucky. 
Of all the days for this to happen, it's on the day Flick is visiting. with me. Okay. Don't move. Hey. The hat was appropriate. Another one. Ugh. Good money. I hate the bug, but right now I'm happy to have him. how quickly they reappear as well. It's, it's instant. There's no waiting around. How much is a coconut worth? Because if six coconuts or eight coconuts are worth less than one bug, then I'm taking the bug. Two fifty per coconut. Okay, so if I get eight coconuts, it's still worth more. I assume the peaches are the same if it's my native fruit. Two more. I like that they don't get scared easily. Very tempted to leave the ladder behind. Yeah, that's fine. I'll be lazy. This was good. Okay, I can leave now. 
pretty good haul. Okay, not bad. <laughs> First two islands, good results. Oh, this is gonna be good. <laughs> nice. 81,000 bells. Good shit. Yep, load the money. I'm gonna just drop the fossil. I wanna keep moving to the next island. I feel like if I have to go back and donate every fossil, it's just gonna take forever. Just do it all in one bulk action later. Who am I going to say no to this time? <laughs> I just wish I didn't have to spend 30 seconds having a conversation. Oh shit, wrong option. If you make a mistake, you have to start the whole thing again. It's like death by a thousand paper cuts for me. Okay, I think, uh, there we go. The, this will be- oh, nope, I'm wrong. It, it has cute eyes, okay. I thought maybe, oh, this might be one that someone might not want, but uh, upon second look... Who are you? 
Gladys. Yeah, I mean, I, I can see, I, I can see how my luck is kind of bullshit. I, I can definitely see that now. Pass. Yeah, it's, I, I'm, it's not the best, but it's still. At least it has some kind of visual appeal. Some of the other ones. There are ones that are objectively not as popular. Like, for example, you can take someone like, um, the one that moved out, right? Already forgotten their name, the gorilla. That's not a popular villager. So it's not like that. You look at it and you're like, okay, yeah, it's, it's fine, but it's, it's not my, my taste. Magilla, that's not their name, but Rocket, Rocket was their name, jeez. Like, that's, that's a villager that immediately you kind of write off and go, okay, well, try again. This one, someone's gonna like this villager. The design isn't bad. Keep hitting McGillow at the net. <laughs> what about the pitfall seed? Just put it out in front of their house. So from what I've been told, the way it works is once every two weeks, you'll get a villager that's deep in thought, right? And when you talk to them, they'll say they want to move out. It's random. So when you get that dialogue, just exit the game. And then the next day, it'll move to another random villager and it'll keep doing that until you either choose to keep like, you either choose to say, oh, stay, or uh, you say move out. And then it, it resets the time to two weeks again. So I just got lucky that um, one day I said no. I, I exited. And then the very next day, it, it changed over to the gorilla. So I got lucky. But you just keep doing that every day. You wait for that bubble to pop up. When it does, just keep closing and then the next day it'll uh it'll move to another villager at the end of the day there's still like a one in ten chance or is it one in nine however, however many villagers you might have that's the odds Gotta suck up on miles. That's what I did for a long time. I haven't panicked yet. It's fine. We still got plenty of miles to go. What do I get as furniture anyway? Piano bench. Okay. To be honest, because I already have... I would prefer this than Phil, you know? I would gladly swap Phil for... for Gladys. If I could. Which one is Phil? The blue one, but looks very similar. Kind of reminds me of Falco. But, uh, yeah, blue. You'll still see Phil around. I had to let Phil move in because Phil was the camper that I got, and the very first camper, you have no choice but to let them move in. Which is a little, a little lame. There's so many char characters, yeah. There's a couple hundred, if I'm not mistaken. Oop. 
people have their favorites. What? How? How, how did that not work? How did that not work? Alright, well, I still say uh, I am three for three in terms of villages that might be wanted by someone. I mean, not many this time, but it's... that's still quite a bit of money. Just from one island. And not sticking around that much. Okay, I'm gonna move money around. So that it doesn't take up inventory space. Curious how many miles I'm gonna use to get this done. There's less pressure this time around. Sawing project. <laughs> okay. Alice gave this as okay. Well, that's fine. Someone, you, you know, it's kind of, kind of, bidding. This is outside of uh, the place that sells clothing, but anyway. I just didn't want to go back to the house. Okay. 
All right, ticket number four. I'm curious if that conversation actually does some loading or something, or if it's just purely just to talk. It's Winnie. No? Yes, it's Winnie. I've had this villager on my island as well. <laughs> no, I didn't expect to see anyone on this island. Nice to meet you, I'm Winnie. People like Winnie as well. Yo, Shambloni, I've totes heard from somebody, Tracool, who's from there. Maybe you know them, their name as well. That's you? Wow, a pair of celebrities on one island. Well, I'm a celeb in training, but it's still fab. I'm skipping, yes, because I've had Winnie before. That's two villagers from my other island that have appeared today. And that's not not bad. Pretty much I'm gonna keep shaking the trees once I get the wasp nest, then I can leave. Or if there's like a water bug that I need to get. Wow. I'm just going through these nuts. Um, okay, this tree will be safe. That makes that significantly harder now. Everything is breaking. Watch this break now and then I have no choice but to go home. I need more branches now. Should be enough for the shovel.
Okay. Um. Wow. It's just I had to to make a good. To make the good, the good net, I have to get a shovel, which then will let me get this, and then I can make both the good net and the good shovel. Okay. There we go. and I got the wasp. Alright. I'll just get the fruit and then I, I can I can leave. Imagine if the ladder was something that broke as well. I'm surprised this, the stick doesn't, given the way you use it. Alright. Uh, was that all the fruit? Let's go home. There's a chance I can run into the same villager twice. I mean, the odds are, are pretty low, but... I would imagine it could happen. I think you probably can, you just have to be very unlucky. Given the sheer amount of villagers there are. Let's flick. There you are.
Alright, that's five tickets now. Probably change clothes just to get that out of the way. And then at least it frees up like another potential ticket. simple. It counts. Okay. Ready to go. Mouse is next. Number five. It's a waterfall. Okay, well, it's another, it's another, uh, potentially Who are you? Hey, I've run into Maple before, haven't I? Maybe I haven't, I don't know. I mean... It's, an, it's just another literal teddy bear. Yeah. Yeah. I mean... It would be a good choice. I don't think I've run into Maple. I think I ran into someone similar to Maple. I'm gonna I'm gonna choose to keep going. Like I'm gonna I'm going to be very picky this time, but you know. I know someone's not gonna like the fact that I didn't take this bear. That's why I saved up all these points. It's I when I know, I'll know.
pretty good find either way. It's just... I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep rolling the dice. I'll start feeling a little more like I should take one or if I get down to say 20,000 points and I still haven't decided. Right now it's, it's still early days. Okay, well since this is... This is a, uh, a mile earner. Let's just get it out of the way. Uh, yep, that's that. Okay, well that one's probably going to happen naturally anyway. Like, it's a good, good day to get that one. Still plenty of tickets left. Oh yeah, this should be wielding the net just in case spider turns up. Just the one. I mean, when you take the fruit into account, this is, uh, it's pretty worth it. For a that was a bug. All right. Next ticket.
I just wish I had the outdoor storage shed. Then I could just place it next to the airport and I won't have to come all the way back here. music. It's probably one of the better music tracks I've gotten so far. I hadn't heard it before today. It just feels like I'm at a market somewhere. Okay. Ticket number six. Okay. What do we got? Oh, it's this island. It's, I, wow, okay. Hello. Robot octopus. Cephalobot, I thought this was a deserted island, but here we both are. I think this one's brand new to New Horizons. Like this is one of the exclusive ones, so it's rare. It tracks. I'm sure someone would definitely want this villager. Well, this is going to be a very quick island. What the hell is this? This only lets me hit it once. Hang on. Oh, it's the only way- wait, is this the only way you can get to the middle? Okay, yeah it is. Alright, I got it. This is a this is a special island. What what's this fish? This, these are big fish. It's a koi pond. So I guess about koi. I mean, I, I might catch three of them just to get a koi fish model. Okay, first things first. That's fine. It's Money Island, so it's the best I could do. If there's a bubble, do you talk to him? If there's a bubble, progress the conversation once, and if they're talking about moving out, close the game. Unless it's the villager you want to move out, of course. But then just avoid talking to that villager. And then the next day, that bubble will move to someone else. The bubble isn't always about moving out. Sometimes it's a request. 
Okay. Alright, well... Hey Sandy, how's it going? Hold on. How do I do this? This one should be good enough for me to do like this, hopefully. Give me a clothing, hope it was a move out. Yeah, it happens once every couple weeks, so. I got a rare island in the rare villager, that's neat. Despite having my store closed and being unable to sell things, I'm getting a lot of money today. Very good. I mean, where is it? It is unique, but I have a clown for my unique villager. Ooh, there's a, there's a, Be happy with that one. Yeah, it's a koi pond. So, wait, what are the, are the tiny ones goldfish then? No, it's a tadpole. I'll catch one, one more koi, because then I have three and I can make a koi model next time. a little lap. Mm. 
Mm. Ah, screw it, I'm being lazy. <laughs> I got more islands to visit. But I got money island. Hey, you're not wearing a pirate outfit. Oh, oh. There you are. If an Atlas moth were to manifest before me, how would I react? Laughter, weeping. Wait, I have an Atlas moth. There you go. Yes. Oh, that's decent. Unless the hint is they're looking in my pockets. Which I guess makes sense. Drop. Again, in the interest of visiting more islands, I just I'm just dropping that off. I guess if I want to make a model, I can always just <laughs> sacrifice the pet that I have. As morbid as that sounds. Okay, out we go. This is what, number seven now? Seven. I don't see the fire, it's probably on the high ground. I hear footsteps. <laughs> nope. <laughs> That's a reject. The plague bringer has has appeared. Oh, 
Oh, look who decided to follow me into this game. Oh, you don't remember me? You're visiting from another island, you don't say. Meeting you here feels like pretty much the way I always thought Destiny would feel. Check it. You have Colton, he's great. No, he's not. Colton's a fucking scam artist. And he brings the plague to your town. Uh, hey, well, I have this item. Can I sell it to you for three times the cost? Wait, you're gonna buy it off me? <laughs> okay, sure. I thought this was a special rock. It's not. Alright, well, this, a lot of people like Colton. A lot of people like Colton. So, this is still chalked up as like, okay, my luck is still good. But... Just... No. <laughs> we already had Colton and New Leaf. That's multiple villages that I've had in other towns. It's gonna make me regret not taking Maple by the end of this. Another mountain bike just dropped from the tree. I've had a lot of good ones today. Tutu, Maple. Um, Winnie appeared again. So did Wade. Maple. Gladys. I think that's all of them. Oh, and the last one, the octopus. I, I don't remember its name. I didn't read it properly. But the robot octopus. Anyway, this one was an easy choice. Uh, I'm good. Oh, it's a marlin. No, scratch that. Blue marlin. That's cool. Okay, <laughs> next ticket. Grouch isn't taking the hand he needs to go. I mean, what I did seemed to work, just the, the rotation thing. Didn't take long for me to be able to get rid of Rocket.
I have made a lot of progress on the home loan, but not really doing anything other than visiting islands. Okay. I will, I will find one that I, I am content with. Being patient this time around, I'm not rushing it. I have plenty of plenty of miles. Plenty of miles. This is not taking into account the fruit that I'm going to sell as well. Because I can't sell it right now. Number eight. It is a bamboo island. Well, this is going to be a quick island. It's just there's not a whole lot here. It's a monkey. Oh, Tammy. Another pop star. I mean, yeah, <laughs> I'm good. I'll pass. Different. No pop stars. What about Audi? I got Audi. Audi's nice. This is pretty much just collect the coconuts and leave, so this one was super quick. As there is no fruit trees. Alright. Next island. I mean, I don't think any villager irritates me. They're just cartoon animals. <laughs> At the end of the day. I'm going more with visual preference, I guess.
I think most of them, that they're, they're fine. Some of the voices can be creepy, but other than that... Very picky when it comes to these villages. The first time I just went with the ones that appeared first. So I'm trying to be a little more picky now, but it's still... It's still not as bad. I wish I had this music on my first island. <laughs> what is it? It's Condor. Okay. Noted. Time for island number nine now. Let's see who we got this time. I just wish it wouldn't take like a whole minute to get to the island every time. Okay. Uh, the campfire is on high ground. It's a pink hippo. Who is this? Biddy. Gonna, I'm gonna move on. <laughs> Someone will probably not like that I didn't take the hippo, but it, it, it's fine. I haven't taken a lot of things today. Multiple that are probably favorites amongst people. I haven't looked at a list. I'm just, I guess, when I see it, I'll know. Kettle bathtub? What does this even look like? Oh. That's like the oil drum I have. Was moving in. Oh, 
ほほほ<笑> I hate it when they do that, but I was prepared. Wow. That's timing. Let's get the rest of the fruit and leave. Now I don't have to worry about being stung. When I start getting below 30,000, closer to 20,000, then I'll start worrying about if I need to take a villager right away. Oh, wait, you get one from five wasps in a row. That's... I don't think I ever got that. <laughs> It's almost paid for a whole other ticket. I don't have a store right now. There you go. It's nice at a bare minimum I make this amount. I should upgrade the fishing rod while I'm here.
that's this is ticket number 10 now i think right or is it nine i've lost count i probably lost count a long time ago Pretty sure it's 10? Okay. Well, let's see. It's been a, it's been an interesting selection so far. I'd say the one that probably didn't personally like the most is the hippo. I mean, look, Colton's, Colton's, I'm just memeing because Colton was a scam artist in New Leaf. I got a good feeling about this one. It's another horse, donkey. Is it a horse or a donkey? I don't know. I haven't seen you before, so this is new. More of a uh, traditional horse color. Elma. Okay. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's, it's about as... It's like the first one I came across was very token teddy bear. This is token horse. Just exactly what I picture when you say horse in terms of color scheme. Approaching the point where I'm gonna have to pick something. <laughs> DJ turntable. <laughs> oh, I got this island again. It would appear I got this island again. <laughs> Unless that was a coincidence. I think 
it, it is this island. Like, it's the same layout. Yeah, it's the same island again, so that's easy money. Again. I might pay off my mortgage today just as a result of this. Oh shit. Ah, oh, damn it. Well, it, it didn't drop directly in front of the tree. It, this was in the way. It's okay. I can craft. It is pretty lenient in that regard. Hey, not that. Why is... Why is drop the first option for medicine? I don't think that should be the case. Alright, well, I'm gonna spend a little time on this island. Because... <laughs> money. I guess I'm wearing this, I have one extra slot. It shouldn't take long to get a whole bunch of these things. <laughs> You're not coming back with me. That's not going to convince me to let you move in. Not so easily swayed. Oh, no. Right. Ah, damn it. Is it going to come back? Not. Nah. Well, so it's not spiders, it's still, still decent. I know the moment I jump across it's gonna it's gonna move away. <sighs> Alright, watch. Oh no, it's already here. Hold on. It's still better to go across.
Okay, that's not gonna move. This island must be very common or something. Like, I can't believe I've gotten it twice. Another one over there. Hey, did it vanish? Must have. Have to work. All right. See ya, Sandy. Enjoy your day. Oh, yeah. There you are. Come here. Bugs. Hello. Oh, there. Uh, nearly there. Nine more. It's worth it. It's like eighty thousand pills. <laughs> I'm making on I'm paying off the mortgage. <laughs> Four more. I thought for sure today was a write off. needed to survive two more. It's okay, I can make a flimsy one and catch the remaining two and then upgrade it then. Flimsy pole. <laughs> Idiot. It's okay. Doesn't matter. I was like, where's the net? I made a rod. Hey, Manny. How's it going? Welcome. Okay. Net. I need a net, not a rod. There we go.
All right, one more. There we go. It sucks not as many people play Animal Crossing. Yeah, but that's just how it goes. It was nice in 2020. It was the game we all needed. Just, there's always new stuff coming out. Even me, I'm not sure how much I'll get to play this next month. And pretty much from the end of October till November, there's just a new game every week, practically. Alright, well that was worthwhile. Where is Flick? There you are. Give money. Yes. So lucky that I decided to do this on the day where she's here. Did I get another villager? Heck, uh, not yet. Uh, I've done ten tickets. Let's see. I've had... Um... Tutu. Maple. Colton. Did, obviously didn't go with Colton. Uh... Who else? Maple, Colton, Flick. Wade. Um, Winnie. A hippo, I forgot which one. The robot octopus. It was like a pink hippo. Robot octopus. Um, I just had a brown horse. I forgot his name. Who else am I forgetting? That wasn't... Who was the other one? I, I, the two bears, the two horses, the hippo. Then there was Wade, the penguin. I feel like I'm forgetting one. Oh, um... It was an ostrich. What, what was the name? I've already forgotten her name. <laughs> but that was the other one. Flick as a boy, I thought it was a girl. Oh, okay. Yeah, I didn't know. It's a bit ambiguous. But I am up to ticket number 11 now. So, I think I've had good luck in the ones that I've found, I just haven't really settled on one yet. Like I said, I'll know it when I see it. <laughs> okay, put this fossil here for now, I'll identify them at the end of the night. Hello, not DMs. Welcome. Alright. I'm gonna start being less picky when the amount of Nook Miles drops below 20,000. For now, I'm still fine. Everything's still okay. I've 
gotten pretty lucky with the islands. I've gotten a money island and two islands that let me catch those bugs, so... I've been making a surprising amount of money given the shop's closed today. Okay. Ticker number 11. I still can't believe I ran into Colton again, of all the villages to run into again. <laughs> the one that I didn't want. It's nothing against Colton visually, it's just he was a scam artist in my town in New Leaf, so... Oh, it's a cherry island. Another hippo. It is... Bertha. Okay. Well, this is just... Cherries, that's it. There's no furniture or wasp from memory. Let's just collect the cherries. So this will be relatively quick. the hippos are the ones uh and the apes are the ones that i don't like from a visual design point of view oh there was the monkey as well who's the monkey i got a yellow monkey that was another one it was the pop star monkey Shadow looks big enough. Not sister, see us. Into the bin. This island will have made me money, just not today. I've also learnt that, um, I think it's this week that the 
the processes I've been waiting on to get announced are gonna get announced. So then I can start looking into the new computer, which I'm kind of excited to do. Just lately, I've definitely been feeling the need to have an upgrade. There's just been a few circumstances with just the higher quality. It's been struggling a little with the PS5, but uh, it is what it is. This computer's seven years old now. It's done its job. Alright, I'll give that to Flick. Okay, that's the silent done. Alright. Still not worried. I have 29,000 miles to go. Hey, happy welcome. How's it going? <laughs> Alright. This is why I dress this way. It's just exploration of islands. I... I'm hoping that I can find someone I want to invite today. Hey. Wait. <laughs> Come here. Have a stink bug. Pausing Animal Crossing by watching Animal Crossing. That's a much deserved break by the sounds of it. Did I find. Yeah, I did. Alright. Onto the fossil pile that I'll identify at the end of the night. My patience will be rewarded. Just see so you wait. Okay, I just gotta drop off the fruit and then we'll head out again. Does anyone wanna take a guess as to what villager I'll find? You have a, a pretty low chance, but if you get it right, man, you should go use that luck. Now this is a problem, I've gathered so much fruit that I'm out of room. It's alright, tomorrow big sale on fruit. They have a whole empty room over there, so I'll probably throw a bunch of fruit in there. Number 12, here we go. Alright. 
I'll be a little sad if I run into the same villager twice. Uh, wah wah. Alright, this is definitely the worst one tonight. <laughs> well, they can't all be good. It's the gorilla with A. I just got rid of a gorilla on the island. I'm not about to invite one. I mean, don't get me wrong. I would prefer this gorilla over what I had, but... Oh. I almost didn't get that. I don't, I don't like the mustache. <laughs> okay, we're pretty much done here now. Just gotta collect this. I'll find out. Hello, who are you? Wait, Caesar? Cesar? <laughs> That's not what I was expecting. You have your wear. Why would you wear? What does the A mean then? Ape? Like I was expecting a name that started with the letter A, because wearing. A piece of clothing that has the letter A on it. I don't know. I suppose it could mean ape. Okay, but otherwise, already done here. That was quick. Ooh, wait a minute, did I get the fossil? I got the fossil, right? Yep. Sorry. It's like midnight brain is almost kicked in. <laughs> it's okay. I'm surprised I haven't run into any spiders, honestly. Every time I've played this at night, I've ran into at least one. Maybe because I haven't hung around town enough. Like, tonight's I've just been island hopping the whole time. Oh boy. Alright. <laughs> At the halfway mark for miles. Almost, yeah, I've spent half the miles I had today.
Oh, yeah. <laughs> so it doesn't fill up everything. Mini right. I have a mini fridge. That's cool. I'll just put it here, I guess. Oh, it's like this, damn. I was expecting one of those cool ones that they are, I guess, more oriented around drinks. It's okay. It's, I know that's in a bad spot. I just want to move and keep going. We have islands to visit. There's already random crap on the floor. <laughs> Okay. I got a good feeling about this one. Just saying. the footsteps. Oh, it's a mouse. I mean, as far as a mouse goes, I'd, pref I'd honestly prefer this mouse over uh, the one I have. You know what? That's a really nice mouse. It's probably the best mouse I've seen so far. If I could just swap over. And I just... <sighs> Get rid of my skeptical mouse and just do a trade, I, I would. But I can't. I don't want two mice. But, I mean, yeah, not bad. I'm not gonna go off the mouse now because I've already got a mouse and... I mean, don't get me wrong, like, it's a nice mouse, but then I'll have two mice. I do want to get rid of the other one, but it'll take a while. Uh, like, I'm, I'm trying to be picky this time around. If, the, if I would have discovered this mouse, like, maybe two villages ago, I would have been like, sure, this is, this is a good choice. I'm not going to waste too many miles. But now that I only have three villages that I can invite left, I'm going to be picky. So far, of all the ones I've come across tonight, I think Maple has been the best one. This one's probably a close second. I 
I mean, 2-2 two -two was fine, but like... The only reason 2-2 two -two worked was it was a teddy bear wearing a love heart shirt, and it's just, well... They're not always gonna wear that. Okay, we're done here. Yeah, I say roll the dice again. It's still a pretty good... It's still a pretty good uh, amount of luck, though. I've only had three that... haven't been that great. The others have been good. I know someone's not gonna like that I didn't pick the mouse. It's okay. Shelf. Okay. Again, so far, I'm still above the threshold of not being too concerned. It's just. In two tickets time, then I'll start to worry a little bit. Well, not including this one. I think that was definitely the best looking mouse. I've seen a lot of mice. So, that one is definitely one of the better looking ones. that I'm just out of room. <laughs> what do you mean? Is it that big? Oh, well. I mean, yeah, this can be like a fruit storage room thematically. I just don't want to sell them and not make as much money as I can. Not when all I have to do is wait. I'm gonna strike out, like, watch, watch it happen, I'm just gonna... ...not find a villager that I like, and I'll regret not getting one of the earlier ones. <laughs> Hello, Camulela, welcome. I am... 
hunting for a new villager. I don't know what I'm looking for, but... I'm just, uh... Cam, ooh la la, gotcha. Fair enough. Alright. Who is it this time? Don't use the ladder the wrong way. Who is that? Ah, oh, come on! That's ah, just unlucky. I ran into this one earlier. The odds of that happening are very low. Well, there you go. I, I, I jinxed myself. I was like, hmm, I wonder if you can run into the same villager twice. The answer is yes. Yes, you can. He's metal. I know, but it's just... I know this one's very unique. But my unique villager is the clown, so... The game is like, take the octopus. We've given you the option twice. Why haven't you taken the octopus? Still have plenty of knock miles. I'll know it when I see it. I mean. just he's just lit up like I don't know if that's it's a robot or what but it might just be a helmet who knows and tentacles look normal I don't know it's kind of hard to see It's definitely cool looking. It's pretty distinct. Wait, where's the wasp? Probably on this side. There you are. Okay, cool. It's just because Flick's in town and it'll sell well. Alright. <laughs> I said no at once already, so I'm sticking to my guns. Yep. I'll have to say yes eventually. Okay, what is that? Like, that's... I was that Island 13? It was, wasn't it? If you believe in bad luck, I guess. figures.
Good luck, if I say anything. It's a sum. At the start of tonight, the mortgage was almost 500,000. <laughs> I'm close to paying it off. And it's not because I've been doing stuff to try and pay it off. This is just a result of the islands I've gotten. Yeah, like, look at this. I think once I sell all that fruit, I'll probably be able to do that tomorrow. You can't believe you heard me say that I skipped maple. Because I feel like I can do better. I was like, mm -hmm. I'm probably going to regret it, but we'll see. Of all the ones I've come across tonight, that one I think definitely was the best one so far. That's okay. That's, I'm gambling here. Like, this is... Trying my luck. I'll move the fruit into the other room. Oops. <laughs> That's not what I wanted to do. It's out of alignment now, isn't it? Yeah, it's fine. I will clean this up. I'll clean this up tomorrow. Or next time. Tomorrow's Tuesday. I keep forgetting. I think I can... Because the coconuts I've only collected to eight, so it should... There you go. Condense like that. I mean, even with this, I'm going to run out of room. The thing is, maple ha happened very early on, so... I was hesitant because I was like, am I really just going to go with the first... The first couple that I ran into? I don't know. Maple was number three, if I'm not mistaken. It's okay, I still, I still got knock miles. It's, it's not a dire situation just yet. I just wish this didn't take one minute every time to do this. Oh, man. Like, you would think, uh... After it's saved, it's ready to go. I don't... I've, I've ran into you before. Fucker. 
I mean, I don't, I don't mind Tucker's look. It's fine. It's just... Like, thematically, it's fine. It's a mammoth. But again, I'm gonna be picky. He's stupid. Why? He's dressed like uh, he fits time period. Nice. That, that'll sell well. You have Tucker. Do you like Tucker? There's having and then there's actually liking Tucker. He's okay. Yeah, that's my thought is he's okay. Not great. But not bad. You know, Rocket was what? Let's put it this way. If at the start, somehow I could pick between Tucker and Rocket, I would take Tucker. This is from Static. There's no more fruit, right? Maybe up here. Yeah, up here. And then I'm done. I don't think people would forgive me if I took Tucker and then was like, man, you could have you could have had maple. Unfortunately, the Nook Miles have kind of stalled. Okay, hold on. Does this count? Let's see, I, I don't know. Oh, it does, wow, okay. I mean, I could should do this back at the island, but just let's just be lazy. So random flowers count. <laughs> That's nice. The more you know. Excellent one to get. That's a subsidized ticket. The next ticket's gonna be cheaper. Yeah, Kiki, Daisy, Chrissy, Anka, Quilson, Agnes, Zucker. Judy, Rudy, and Gonzo. Okay. I think I, I had Judy as like a uh, happy home builder. I think I don't know. Aside from Kiki, I don't know the other ones. Gonzo, actually, no. Gonzo is the koala. I know Gonzo. I have Daisy. Oh, yeah, right. The dog. I haven't gotten familiar with Daisy yet. Daisy was the latest addition. Very terrible with names, but then eventually it does sink in. Oh, 
Okay, um, produce, I can do that fairly easily. What did I get? Air circulator? I mean, look. I'm running out of room inside. I'll just place it there. I'll do something with it. This is nice, though. I got a rebate. Dude, it's been three hours. How have I been doing this for three hours? Catch fish. <laughs> three hours of saying no. Could have been 30 minutes if I took maple. That's true, but it's just life. Sometimes you get something right away and you go with it and you're happy. And then other times you get a little greedy. With the other villagers, I went with it immediately. The moment I saw them, I was like, okay, cool. It's just because I'm down to the final three. I'm trying to be a little more picky. It's fine, I'm getting to see villages I've never seen before. And then, in future games, I'll... I'll have a better frame of reference. But yeah, it's just because I, I... I have been pretty decisive this whole way through. And I have the miles. What the... There's a spot here, what do you mean? Oh, no, wait, drop item, idiot. Ugh. Yep. I kept picking put in storage because I just defaulted to that. That's what I've been doing all night. Okay, that one I can do on the island. That's just easier. I probably should have cleared those ones off the board sooner. It's okay. <laughs> This is fourteen now. I should probably stop counting. It's not like it matters. Okay. It's a wo wolf? It's a wolf. I'm not sure who it is.
I mean, it's kind of plain. Vivian. Pretty, pretty plain. At the end of the day, when I get down to the last 10,000 miles or so, then I'll go... I have the best wolf, yeah. When I get to the last 10,000 miles, that's when I'll go, okay. When one is visually appealing, I'll just go for it right away. Because then I'm playing with fire, it's like, okay, I could potentially get something I don't like. Right now it's still fine, but I'm not worried yet. But at that point, that'll give me five tickets to find something. And then wait for them to move out. Well, I still got two others that I want to move out, so it wouldn't be the worst case. You know, because at the very least I picked it to some degree. So the mouse still has to go. But it'll be fine. It'll still be an upgrade over Rocket. That's, that's my plan, is just once it gets to 10,000 miles, from that point forward, when I see a villager that I think is visually appealing, that's it. That's, that's what I'm going with. I swear if I get that octopus a third time, I, I will probably go with the octopus. There's no way that I find that thing three times tonight. The odds of that happening. Like, I have to pick it at that point. How many villages are there in total? Anyone? I'm just like 400. Okay, so out of so out of 400, let's say that it's 400, right? I have nine of them on in my town. So let's just say let's say 390. One in 390 chance to run into a particular villager. I ran into the octopus twice tonight. So you know, mathematically speaking. 413, alright, cool. So it's like 400. Let's just round it to 400 to make things simple. 1 in 400 chance of running into any villager. The odds of running into that octopus twice tonight, kind of insane. To run into it a third time, I have to pick it at that point. Just the odds of that happening in the same day, no. It's like how with Daisy I was wearing the same sweater as Daisy. I was like, okay, well, this is definitely um, a faded encounter. I feel like that's what would happen with the octopus if I was to run into it a third time. Sack. Okay, well that one's easy. I'll just talk the three villages when I get home. But yeah, no go with this one. Not bad, but too plain. What theme am I going for my island? I haven't decided yet. Like, I'm kind of winging it. 
It'll highly depend on what I find, but at the very least, it's going to involve these two gnomes being the guards, the entry to it. I'm just not sure. I'm not at that point yet. Once I get to the point where I've gotten all my villagers, then I will be decisive and go with something. I'll make something out of what I have. Like, I, I can work with anything as long as I, I look at uh, what items I have. I think coming up with a theme beforehand and then just going crazy trying to find the items to make it work. Uh, I'm not in the mood for that. But I think adapting based on what items I have, I'll, I'll find that interesting. I'll come up with something. Pretty good when it comes to that stuff. There, now we can listen to this music out in the yard. <laughs> Where do you buy music from the, uh... It's not an ATM, but you know, the thing in, in the, the town center. I'll call it an ATM, because I've forgotten the real name <laughs> at the moment. But you just go there, you go nook shopping, and then there's a new one every day. So just check in daily, and you can buy one song each day. Or when KK Slider visits your island, eventually, um, he has a concert, uh, correct me if I'm wrong, but Sunday. I might be wrong. It's one of the days of the weekend. And then, yeah, it's, you just sit on his concert and he gives you a copy of the song he plays. Okay. Talk to three villagers. So happy to see you, Bow Wow. I just love seeing and smelling all the cherry blossom petals dancing in the air all over the island right now. One. Hey, how's it going, Hong Kong? <laughs> There's nothing like spring on Chamblonia, I'm just basking in it, Will. Dang, trendy foxtrot. Let's chat. I was like way into this walk, but then it started to get boring. Then I found you, and it's fab again. I mean, I'm definitely happy with the villages I have so far. Aside from the starting two, which I had no control over, and uh, the camper, which I also had no control over. Everything else has been good so far. Eh, I won't pay anything yet. Um, this machine, so... You go nook shopping... Tutorial. Um, and then, you know, you'll be able to buy one each day. I've already purchased that song today. I don't think I'll get to spend all these tonight. But just looking at it, I'm, I'm, I still have 18,000 miles and it's almost midnight. <laughs> I kind of underestimated how long this process takes. It's okay. The problem is... Do villagers randomly move in if you don't pick one, or does it stay empty? I can't remember. 
If it stays empty, I have nothing to worry about, but if a villager is going to, say, randomly move in, potentially, well... You get a day and then the random person moves in. Well, this is the day. <laughs> so, the answer is yes, someone's gonna move in. Shit. Okay, okay. Okay. Wait a minute. Tomo tomorrow. Hold on. Tomorrow. 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 Like five a.m. or tomorrow at midnight. Because tomorrow at midnight is is in three minutes. And do I need to set the clock back? <laughs> five a.m. Um, I might check in a sec. It's an eagle. I reckon I see the wings already. Amelia. I've never run to anyone else here. I was starting to feel like a castle and desert an island, and you were here. What a relief. Anywho, I'm Amelia. Pleasure to meet you. Why am I only seeing big fish again? Is this a special island? Hold on. Or is this just a coincidence? Oh, wait a minute. It's this island again. I think. Hold on. At the very least, catch this thing. This is 3,000 bells. The, the colors, the red and blue just doesn't sit well with me. It looks like someone that's going to like a football game or something, you know? That's the team colors, red and blue. Our football or American football? It, do it doesn't matter. Any sort of sports where people paint their faces to the team colors. That's pretty universal. I mean, granted, they probably wouldn't do that at, say, something like the tennis, where it's like the Olympics or something. I don't think people would paint their faces for that, but sports where painting your face is common, football, hockey, maybe soccer to some degree, I don't know. <laughs> I bet you would get kicked out of a tennis match if you painted your face and was like yelling obnoxiously like you would at a football game. It'd be funny to see, but you'd probably get kicked out. I think people do paint their faces actually at tennis games, but they're quiet. They they don't do the the loud, you know, yelling. They do it in cricket. You've never been to a tennis game. Me neither, but I've watched them on TV. 
And I feel like I've seen face painting at the Australian Open, but I might be wrong. This could be a false memory. Okay, furniture and wasp. Alright, we're out. It's whenever the sport is at a national level, I believe that's when people do the green and gold paint on their faces. When it's not at the national level, then nah. My airport is green, yours is orange. Yeah, I didn't, I kind of felt like, I swear, my original airport was blue, but I didn't want to say anything. I mean, it, it kind of lines up better. You know, with the flag, it's coincidental. Um, it is now past midnight, so... I guess... Does it say it's reserved for someone? No, okay. So, yeah, it's 5 a.m. We're fine. <laughs> when I was picturing someone painting their face at a tennis match and yelling, I was picturing Patrick Warburton's character from Family Guy. And just the way he yells, I don't know, I just see that, that it's such a perfect jock, vo jock voice. And just Patrick Warburton, that's who I imagine, screaming at a tennis match. I got five hours to find someone. I'm not going to be around for five hours, but at least it's nice to know that I don't have to stress a bit about, like, forcing a decision just yet. Accessory stand. Yeah, I mean... <laughs> Kind of outside an appropriate building. Unless I change the clock back and keep it on the state till tomorrow. I could do that, but... I think I, I just need to make a decision. Let's see if I can put these two in storage. Yes, good. If nothing else, the mortgage will definitely get paid as a result of this. What else do I need to do? Complete DIY projects, okay. Uh, I'm trying to think what I can do. Well, the panic begins in three tickets, so four tickets, including this one. Hmm. See, the problem with this is I don't know how much longer this is going to take. And this is kind of the point where I should probably split the video for YouTube. But it could be a case of this is the last... That's the problem, is I've kind of reached this awkward point of no return where it's... I should have split it maybe an hour ago. Maybe I might have to do some creative editing and just <laughs> split it manually later. We'll see. It's just no one really watches longer 
longer VODs on YouTube. I found they do better if they're between one to two and a half hours. Three hours is like probably the most. Depends what you're doing. Basic cow. Oh crap, I should have caught that. Tip off. I don't like the eyes, and it's just, I get. It's the same reason I didn't go with the other wolf, it's just too plain. And this is. Ba I've gotten basic cow, basic teddy bear, basic wolf, basic horse. This just reminds me of the time I was looking for a kangaroo for my other island. It took a very long time and a lot of tickets, but it did happen. I say a very long time, but it was one day, really. <laughs> A lot of tickets were spent in one day. I missed it. Who'd I get? Uh, basic cow. Just straight up basic cow. Basic cow. Standard cow and the eyes, I don't know. <laughs> I just don't like the eyes. It's okay, but it's it, like, it's the same reason I don't go with the other wolf. It's just too plain. Or the horse. Not at the point of panic just yet. Like I said, t when it gets to down to 10,000 knock miles, that's when I'll consider settling for something. That's when it'll be okay. Whichever one I think is fine for now, that's what I'll go with. This is, this is gonna be four hours. It's just gonna be that. That's, 
This is there's still the fruit that I haven't harvested from today as well, like. What am I gonna do with all that fruit? I guess I can keep some of it in the inventory. And it's not like I've completely filled up the house with fruit yet. I should be able to condense one pile of coconuts though. Like. If I do this, it, I should end up with one less, because it's a stack of eight. So then this should be one less stack. Probably the same for the peaches as well, let's see. Okay, I know this is a lot of effort. What did I even get? A hose reel that can go outside. Okay, I know now I know that that coconut's the the one that needs stacking and this Peach is the one that needs stacking. Jeez. <laughs> the fruit is not going to be as much money as I think it'll be. I mean, it'll be a nice amount, but not as much as I think. Okay, hose reel. Makes sense, right? There we go. I got the cow. No, I didn't get the cow. But, like, hang on. Are you saying I got the cow as in... I found the cow or went with the cow? I did not go with the cow. No, too... too plain. Thought I went with the cow. No, I didn't go with the cow. Too plain. It said I didn't go with the cow for the same reason I didn't go with the other wolf. It's just too plain. Or the... the other horse. Uh... It's just, like, st stock standard horse. So, still looking. Thought I settled. No, 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 no. I said, uh, I'm gonna start, I'm gonna start to consider to settle once I get below 10,000 miles. That's when it'll be a case of, well, whatever is good enough at that point. So, there's still another three tickets before it gets to that point. Three tickets. Okay. <laughs> I'm starting to sweat a little. I forgot how many knock miles I started with. I think I, it was close to 50,000 knock miles. 
Oh, I got God. cherry thing again, so yay, more fruit that I need to store somewhere. Where's the fire? There's the fire. I thought it was going to be white again. Um, I have run into Aurora before, I think. I should have went with Maple. I know. But Maple was very early on, and I just thought, oh, am I really going to go with another one that I'd find right away? I want this to be a thing where I'm rewarded for my patience. I have run into Aurora before. Not today, but in the past. Like I said, I'm gonna give it until I get to 10,000 Nook Miles. That's when the panic will begin. <laughs> right now, just, just, just be patient. That's, that's fine. That's, I think this villager is okay. Just okay. I swear I'm gonna- uh, if I end up with another ape, that's gonna be funny. Ultimately, it's just- I went to the effort of making Rocket move out, and then I end up with another ape for my greed. Hello, MCS. How's it going? Ugh. Well, I mean... I think it's gonna time out okay, because it's- I can probably be up for another hour before I should get some sleep. So I think in that hour I can get through the Nook Miles. What if I find Magillar again? Oh, I think I'm just gonna go to bed. And just be like, fuck it. Just take, take the wheel. Just give me whatever villager tomorrow, that's it. <laughs> just anything. Just pick one for me. If I run into the villager that I, I, uh, I made move out yesterday. I've already run into the same octopus twice in one day, so... When that happens, it's just, you know what, just... Game can do whatever it wants. Playing Animal Crossing as well, cool, cool. You doing anything in particular? I've been on this villager hunt for the last three and a half hours. I'm not looking for something in particular. Or specific, I guess. It's more of a... I haven't seen many villagers, so I want to see a bunch of them and then pick one that I think I like, I guess. And ultimately, I'm going to regret not picking maple by the looks of it. I don't have amiibos for this game. I do not, no. begins in two more tickets. Starting dailies and then you gotta pick a spot to put an incline. Oh, that's always a tough one. I didn't really know where to put mine, so I, I kind of put them somewhere random just for the time being, just to get it out of the way. And then later I'll probably move them. It's tough that you have to commit to a layout early on. Did I get a bug? I don't think I did. Oh, yeah, okay. It's because it was a, uh, 
the fruit island. Okay. So many knock miles. <laughs> All right, we're, we're approaching approaching that number, approaching the number where I will start panicking a little. is loosely based off the TV show Grimm. Never heard of it. What's Grimm about? I haven't decided on a theme yet. I'm gonna wing it based on what I have and just be creative about it. Take what I find and then do something. At the very least it'll involve the two gnomes at the entrance. They'll be my guards. One of these was a stack of seven, I don't remember which one. <laughs> okay. Oh man, it feels like that one time I went all in on the... the turnips, and I just had them everywhere on the island. Not quite as bad, but I just have those memories. Okay, manifest a good villager for me, chat. <laughs> Let the manifesting begin. I should have gone with... <laughs> I should have gone with Maple. <laughs> that was like three hours ago. It's okay. It's a good show. It's a modern spin-off if the creatures from Grimm's fairy tale were real, and where only certain people can see them for what they are. Oh, okay. <laughs> Alright, let's see if it worked. Manifestation. Go, go. I see... It's a, it's a, it's a gorilla. <laughs> Shit! I got rid of a gorilla! I don't want another gorilla. I just got rid of one. Although, to be fair... Hans? To be fair... Oh, okay, no, never mind. I was like, oh, let's just say... Nope, the nose. <laughs> it's pig... pig gorilla. Jeez. Okay. I thought maybe it might have a redeeming quality. No. It looks like it's like an assistant for Dr. Frankenstein. Alright, well. <laughs> I've run into two gorillas today. Alright, well the next ticket's the last one. After that, it's going to be a case of whichever villager that I run into that I think is, is fine, that's the one I'll go with. Like, just okay. I will settle for okay. 
as to not prevent a disaster. I can't believe it's another gorilla. Is there anyone that genuinely likes the gorilla characters? So far, I mean, I don't know much about the this game. Like, New Horizons was my first game. However, if there's one thing <laughs> that I know, it seems to be almost universal that gorillas just no one wants them. I don't know why. I have yet to meet a person that is happy with a gorilla on their island. Okay, that's... I've got to find the furniture now. There we go. All right. Yeah. It is... It is interesting. Out of all the villages, there are so many cool ones than the gorillas. Hmm. I just think it's weird. I don't know. There's just something about them. <laughs> I can't put my finger on it. I, it's just... It's a bit of the shape. I think it's the shape more than anything else. I don't know. I think if they looked a bit more like Donkey Kong, I might be okay with them, but... Hard to say. Oh yeah, I'm not bringing anything from this island home. <laughs> whatever, whatever remains on this island can stay there. Okay, well, it's almost time for panic. This is, this is the last ticket before I, I am a little concerned. There are six tickets I can... I can use. Um, hold on. Is there something I can craft with this? Nothing. I need to make something so then I can earn more Nook Miles. Potentially get another ticket out of it, I don't know. gotten cash out of these sounds. Oh yeah, no, was, at the start of tonight I had about 500,000 on the mortgage and it's, it's gonna be paid off as a result of this, like, this is definitely worth it either way. It's definitely more interesting than just sitting there and fishing that amount of money, let's put it that way. <laughs> Like, if I was to earn the same money from fishing, it, it would, uh, certainly be something I wouldn't do in one sitting. Okay, what can I make that's easy? Okay, that one I can convert to a better one. Fish bait, yeah. Um, 
Okay, I know what I can do. I wanted to make this anyway, so it gets rid of a stack. Um... Maybe another Halloween theme thing. Let's see. Oh, there we go. There's some stuff I can make. So this one's an easy one. That one I'll definitely use somewhere. That's such a good one. Um, that one... I mean, I suppose just to stick with the Halloween thing, it's easy, and we'll just go place it somewhere. I forgot to go to Flick. Um, okay. <laughs> the music is catchy. It just reminds me of going to a market and having those kind of bands selling their CDs. Okay, well that, is it produce or is it flowers? Flowers I can do on the actual island visit. You know it's getting late for me when I'm pressing the wrong button <laughs> constantly. Okay. So the manifesting didn't work <laughs> this time. I will try and manifest it myself. Let's see. It's like that that book that everyone went crazy over, like, a, I don't know how many years ago. It was just, oh, if you want something, you just gotta think about it and imagine it, and then you know, you'll get it. Almost bedtime. Yeah. And is that how that works? Well, I don't know. I, I didn't read the book. I just remember it was a thing. It was on TV everywhere. I should probably catch that. That's worth some money. Australian picnic. Just put your favorite fan down and then sit down and enjoy. Uh... Yes, there's room. Stop. I want to put it next to... There. That's fine. Doesn't have to face forward all the time. Alright. Two needs to work. Well, I think... I don't know. Um, you know what? I'm not even going to try and attempt to justify the book. But I would I would think that the reasoning behind it is just... You're obviously still working for it, but you're imagining that you're having it. So you're not really... You're not really having doubt in your mind that you're going to get the thing that you want. Again, I probably shouldn't try to defend it, because I, I have no idea. I haven't read it. I'm just going to shut up. Look. It might be that, it might not be that. I would hope it's that, because then at least it has some foundation that I can believe. But just sitting there and wanting something, and just continuing to do that until it happens, without working, I don't know.
I know that all I know is that book was made fun of a lot, so. It's a, another cow. It's a less boring. Is that a Guy Fieri cow? No, the eyes. <laughs> the eyes are too derpy. Ang oh, the, the, no. Angus. The eyes. It's a bull. Okay. Still. Okay, well, now we've officially entered panic mode. So the next five tickets, I'm gonna go with the one that I'm like, all right, you know what? This is okay. This is fine. We're in, we're in the danger zone. the part where you, you tell me I should have gone with uh, Maple. I'd probably be in bed, I'd be asleep by now. Or maybe not. Maybe in like another hour. But, I mean... Would it really be that entertaining if I went with the first, you know, well it wasn't the first, in the context of how many tickets I've spent tonight, it's one of the first. And I've done that every time, I've just been kind of fortunate with my finds, so I wanted to see just more villages and I guess see how lucky I can get. So. Alright, we're done with this. The luck has been or the luck has been okay. I think tonight it's been a 50-50 split of villages that I could have gone with. And ones where it's like, oh no, I'm not going with those. It's been 50-50. Roughly. Now, compared to my track record prior to this, yeah, it's a little unlucky. But overall, it's it's fine. All right. I can't believe these flowers count. There we go. Catch bugs. Excellent. That's a great one to get. I'm really hoping, I, now I'm kind of hoping I run into that octopus a third time, because that would be pretty miraculous. And it would make for a good story, at least. It's like, not only is it a pretty distinct looking villager, but I can say I ran into it three times in one day. Which, the odds of that are pretty, pretty damn low. It's not going to happen, but it would be pretty funny if it did. I think the, the only thing that's more likely to happen is just running into Rocket. I run into Rocket again, because of course... Oh hey, it's the villager that I got rid of. Nice to see you. Okay. Ugh, man. What happened to you? You ran into a villager that you got rid of? Right away, or...?
<laughs> right away, damn. What are the odds? One in 400, apparently. Assuming your village is full. Top of that. Okay, first panic ticket. Here we go. <laughs> oh man, I had so many knock miles today. This just means that I'm going to have to grind a whole bunch of them again for the next villager that I want to make move out. But I guess I got time to do that. Okay. Well, who's the next one? The mouse. Skeptical mouse. <laughs> It's pretty much the, my starting two villages, they just weren't great. Okay, well. That's, I guess, fine. It can act like as a rustic table. I don't know. I, I just, I don't have space because I filled my inventory with food. Even this room is, is just... Okay. This was fun, but, like, now we need to stop messing around. <laughs> it's time. I, I have to- I have to pick something. I've only got five tickets left. A duck? Okay. Uh, what duck is it? I can't see what duck. Ooh, what duck is this? Dina? No. Let me see the face again. Um, what do we, what do we think? It's, it's the, there's something, uh, I don't know. It, it's okay, but... Uh, I have four tickets. 
Just a sec. Let's see if this works. <laughs> I'm not that crazy about like I'm not too crazy about it. That, that's just my in my initial thought right now. I'm gonna collect the fruit and I'll see how I feel about it. I did put a poll up, so it'll be up for a minute. Unless I go collect stuff. I'm leaning towards no. There's still four tickets left. Okay, well, one vote. <laughs> but it's reaffirming no. No, oh, that's, that's cool. Shake the tree. I will go with no. Why is drop why is drop the first option for you for medicine? Okay, well. I guess we're going again, huh? I got a plastic pool. Three more chances? Well, it's four. It's four. I guess I would want to have it done in three. But four would mean I'm going with whatever number four is. It's three that I get to pick from. Four. If I go to four, four, the fourth one I have to take, pretty much. Or I would roll it, you know, and go, okay. None of the tickets gave me something that I went with, and then just let the game do its thing. That's the other option. So it's three that I get to choose, yes or no. One, where it's just like, well, that's it. Or I can just make this entire endeavor pointless and just let the game pick for me tomorrow. Jeez. I feel like I have to choose something. I can't let the game pick for me. That would make these four hours just so anticlimactic. It's just... I don't know. There's something about the eyes. Everything else is fine. It's just there's something about the eyes. I don't know what it is, but it's just... I, I don't know. Imagine the game picking a maple for me. I know, I know. I should have I should have just gone with maple and just stuck to my my current streak where I'm getting good villages pretty much right away. I know. But I want it to be interesting. Hell, I should have gone with the octopus the second time it appeared. That probably would have been a good option too. It's like a creepy doll. I think that's what it is. 
I think that's what it is. It just has this weird stare. Hey, look, I made a fool. There you go. No, I gave up maple. But can you blame me? Like every other villager I've gotten just by spending one or two tickets. I wanted to be interesting. I wanted to see more villagers. Like, come on. If I picked maple, everyone would be like, oh my god, you get all the villagers right away. I have to look for ages. You don't have to put any effort and you get good villagers. Like, I think either way I was screwed. Uh, this is my luck. It's so chaotic. It's but every time I have good luck, something like this happens. Do you remember the sturgeon fish? Last day of the season, I go to catch the sturgeon fish. I crafted two hundred pieces of bait. Did not appear. The countdown to midnight, about to clock over to October, I'm like, alright, well, I'm not gonna find this. In the last 30 seconds, I get the damn fish. 30 seconds to spare before it went to October. And then the fish was gone. Or the golden trout. I was like, okay, I don't want to, I don't want to have people sit here and watch me craft like 200 pieces of bait again. I'm going to craft 80 pieces of bait and then I'm going to go look for the golden trout. I catch the damn thing using three pieces of bait. <laughs> so now I have whatever amount I had remained though. Just, I can't do math right now. <laughs> It's, it's approaching 1am, Brain is like, what are you doing? Basic arithmetic is not for 1am. Okay. This, this was funny, this was funny game, but I really need you to just give me, give me a villager now. Okay. Okay. this okay we're done this is good this is fine yes thank you please come to my island I will go I will go with you 
Yeah. Yes. Okay. It's true. It must be true what they say about how travel broadens your horizons. This change of scenery is giving me a new perspective on life back on my island. I like it well enough, but move to my island. Oh wow, that's such a great idea. Thank you for encouraging me. When I ran into you, I never expected to be invited to your island unless you were just teasing me. Do you really mean it, bud? Yes, you'll love it there. That was so exciting. I can't wait to start packing up for my big move after this tour. If I remember right, I'm supposed to contact someone named Tom Nook about relocating, bud. I better do that before I forget. Okay. Ugh. <laughs> you know what? This makes- this- this is fine. At least the outcome was good. I didn't run out of Nook Miles and... I think... It's- it's on the same level, level as Maple. I think both are pretty good. So... This is- this is a good outcome. It took... Four hours and... Almost four hours and twenty minutes to get to this point again. <laughs> but... There you go. Yeah. And all I had to do was just say, okay game, this is funny, but can you give me a, a villager? And the game was like, all right, all right, fine. Have your good villager. Stressed you out enough. I just had, all you have to do is ask sometimes, that's it. Well, but I hope the last four and a half hours were were entertaining. <laughs> uh, I still should have gone with Maple, but you know what? The end result is still great. And it could have gone down a very bad path. As I could only buy another two two more tickets before panic would have truly set in. Okay. It's funny, the game just gave me a trophy case. Like... <laughs> hey, if I want to pat myself on the back, have a trophy case. Okay. Oh, man. Well... For the next villager, I'm still gonna be as picky. I'm not changing it. The only villager that I want is Scoot, and that I will make an effort for in the end. As the last villager, potentially. But the next one is gonna be probably the same process. We'll see. I just like Scoot. Wow, that could have scared that away. Okay. <laughs> oh, man. It, right, yeah. Well, now I have to grind another 50,000 knock miles for the next one. I did it! <sighs> ah, old man, stretch! <laughs> it's 1 a.m. Okay. Just go sell to. Uh, oh right, I gotta harvest the fruit. But I can keep the fruit in my inventory. I don't have to drop it.
If I had not gone with that villager, I would have ended up with a gorilla. <laughs> that's... that's what would have happened. Honestly, enough stuff has happened to me when I play games that I know that that would have been the end result had I not just gone, okay, yep, this is it. Feels like a massive weight has <laughs> just been lifted from my shoulders. Iron ladder setup. Iron ladder? That's interesting. I don't think I ever got this. I guess a different color. I guess it'll be a couple of weeks that I'll have to raise the Nook Miles. Which, yeah, the thing is, in a couple of weeks, Mario comes out, so we'll see how much time I get after that point. I'm still trying to play this where I can, but the next month is gonna be pretty stacked. Why do I always miss those? Or am I just swinging at something that isn't even something I can get? I might be seeing things. I decided to move all the fruit to the southern side. Where's your pirate outfit? <laughs> Where's your pirate outfit? I want you to be a pirate clown. how much I'm gonna make from the fruit tomorrow. So I got... How many tickets would I have spent? Like, I, I think I spent almost 20. 20 islands worth of fruit, practically. Yeah, and that's not including the bugs, and I got the money island twice. It's just it's good all around. Definitely better than having to fish for this amount of money.
I was like, where's that music coming from? I put this music down. Ah. I should probably move it here, because that's going to happen again. There we go. Hot rack, I guess that's a kitchen thing. if I can get my old switch, start up the old island and get my my other file to visit this file <laughs> so then I can hand over some fruit. I bet it's probably possible. Because you do open the island with a code, so... Pot up. Ow. <laughs> yeah. I guess I got a choice of color. I don't have room to put it away. I will fix it tomorrow. <laughs> but the next time. I need to sell just this insane amount of fruit that I have. Okay. I'll pick up whatever fruit I can. Not that. I can... Okay, hold on. Um, not that it matters, but drop... I just want to get the ones that are stacks of 10. Yeah? Okay. Alright. <laughs> I am ready for the big sell next time. Alright, well. This is, this is it for today. If you're watching this later on YouTube, thanks for sticking around till the very end. And I hope you enjoyed this massive hunt. I'm glad that it, it ended well. <laughs> if you want to support the channel, uh, easiest way to do so, just click one of those buttons, particularly the ones that have the thumbs up on them. Helps out a lot. Or uh, you can watch one of the other videos that have popped up on your screen if you want to watch me play something else. But till next time, bye YouTube.